Hi guys, in this quick video I'm going to show you how to remove a password from a Dell laptop a Latitude E 6400 in this case by using a, a free website. You need uh, this number that the laptop generates when uh, asking for a password and the website is this one biospassword.eu slash free slash and uh, your laptop uh, needs to have a, a service tag ending in uh, in these uh, letters otherwise it will uh, probably uh, not work mine has an 2A7B it is already selected and uh, I will just enter the first number, this one right here. I will enter it in this box. So it is 6 uh, X Z Q 2 L 1 and uh, the model is uh, correct. I clicked uh, calculate and this is what it tells me uh, hold control button and press enter key twice to accept the password and now I'm going to start typing this password into the affected laptop it's a quite long one so it will take me a while be sure uh, not to make mistakes because uh, uh, you cannot see it while you are typing I use caps lock just to make sure uh, I'm not uh, wrong anywhere but I just I might have done something wrong here actually backspace and no while talking to you I messed up <laughs> so yeah, let's do this again now it uh, caps lock is on and it has to be off now on again off it's still off and on again this should be the correct password and I just have to hold the control button and press enter twice if would, it would actually work let me try and do it like this nothing let me move to ok with the tab I moved to ok press control again and try enter twice weirdly it's not doing anything so I'm just going to click OK it worked I have no idea why it uh, did not work uh, with uh, this how they told me probably because mine was actually only administrator uh, locked not the whole BIOS probably this works when the whole BIOS is locked I've unlocked uh, even a BIOS like that and it worked but in this case just a click was uh, all that was required and at this point uh, let me just uh, come on exit and try to enter the BIOS once more to see ok it seems it is ok now <laughs> <laughs> in my case I was quite stupid I should have removed the administrator password so basically I just entered a universal password but I did not remove it pretty dumb of me but from my stupidity you learn so again um793 and 09 s 
J. The weird thing is that I don't really remember uh, where is it security uh, needing to actually remove the password myself after uh, doing uh, entering this password on the other laptop. I think on that one it actually removed uh, the password by itself. But in this one you can see here it's uh, still password set. So enter the new password. If I click on OK, would that be enough? All password was not correct. So yeah, it lets me enter the BIOS. Let me try and type the same thing here and try to, to remove it. Uh, the touchpad is re working really bad on, on the E6400 uh, in the BIOS. I have no idea why on both of these laptops it's doing the same thing. Okay, let's type it again. Okay, it's uh, typed now, let me try and click OK. OK, now we have not set. It's a little bit weirder on this model, on the other one, I, I honestly, I, I think I didn't have to do any of this. I just entered it and it was cleared, but uh, that was a little bit different. Probably I will put also that video, I don't really remember if I already uploaded it or not. But I will put also that video. So at this point, let me try and if this would actually work. Weirdly, it's a not quite driver, but in Windows, after you install the driver, it will work perfectly. So I'm going to let it F2. Boot sequence, you can see clearly that I can change anything, so the password is removed. So yeah, this has been the, the video. Let me just zoom on the address once more. And you can actually remove uh, passwords from Samsung, from HP, Fujitsu, uh, more, more laptops you can unlock on this uh, website. So it's, uh, it's pretty useful. So yeah guys, this has been it. Thanks for watching. Uh, check out my other videos. Give this video a like if you found it useful and see you again in the next one. Bye!